Okay, to export the users from Firebase, um, you'll see over here that we have our users list in our authentication uh, tab. We'll need to use the Firebase CLI. If you don't have the Firebase CLI installed, you can go to the Firebase docs on Google and have a look at the overview of how to install it on the different systems and with different options to install it. Once you have that installed, you can go to your command line and you can run Firebase just to check that it's all working properly. It should give you a whole lot of help options. It might take a bit of time because it connects to the server. And we've got all the options over here which are a little bit overwhelming. So the first thing we want to do is just look at the projects we have available and then from there we can get the project ID and export the users. So to get the projects that are available you can use Firebase projects colon list and that will list all our projects. You can see we only have the one project and um, the important part to note here is the project ID. We'll be using this project ID in the next command to specify the project that we want to export the users from. Great, the next command is going to be our auth export command. So we'll see Firebase auth colon export. So it's going to export our users from our author authentication system. We specify the the file that we'd want to put the users in and we also, also specify the file format or the data format. You've got the option between JSON and CSV here. Then the last thing we need to specify is the project ID. So we can just say dash dash project and then copy our project ID from our list and put it in. Now if you run it, it will take a little bit of time and it will populate that Firebase users.json file with the users on our Firebase application. Okay, so let's have a look inside that file and make sure that our users are there. There we go, we've got two users there. And if we have a look on our Firebase console, we can see that it's the same two users.